Hello guys, it is your boy Vendetta, aka the Steam Investor. Welcome to my channel. The Steam market has crashed and in this video I'm going to explain to you why it crashed and what you should do about it. But firstly, make sure you subscribe if you like the video, press the like button. If you dislike the video, press the dislike button and don't forget to leave a comment. Okay, now that we've got the boring stuff out of the way, let's get started. So let me explain to you what has happened. As you probably already know, a new operation has been released recently. The operation is called Broken Thing. With this operation, there are new cases, new skins, new maps, and a bunch of other stuff I don't really care about. However, this has had a massive impact on the Steam Marketplace for CSGO items. Prices of skins, cases, stickers, and agents have all crashed. Let's get started with agents. Here we have special agent Ava. She's a very common sort of agent that is traded a lot on the marketplace. I believe that she is popular with the very rare and mythical female CSGO player. But here you can clearly see that the price dropped from about $10.50 down to about $7 Australian. This is a massive drop of 37%. Next we have another agent called Razan the Ready. Apparently this dude takes pride in his work, so he doesn't have much in common with myself. Anyways, enough bullshitting about, let's have a quick look at the price of this agent. Just like with Ava, we can see the sudden price drop from over 3 Aussie bucks down to less than $2. This must be a bit disappointing to anyone who has this agent in the inventory, as the price was trending upwards for the past week or so. Now that we've got the agents out of the way, let's have a look at what has happened to some cases. I believe the Shadow Web case was released earlier this year, so this was the most current case before the new operation dropped. Here we can see a similar pattern to the agents, another big price drop. The Operation Breakout case has also dropped quite a bit. So if you are hoarding thousands of these in your inventory, you probably took a big hit recently. So we just went over a couple of the mid-tier cases in which still held some value. In this picture, we literally see millions of garbage cases on the marketplace. These are the types of cases in which you tend to get from jobs for free if you have a premium account. They are basically not even worth the effort of putting them up for sale in the first place. Pretty much useless unless you want to hold on to them for a long time and hope that prices go up. Now to the gun skins. Let's start with the orps. Here we've got the orp fever dream. A decent looking skin, but by looking at the big price drop, it looks like it has caught a certain type of fever itself, if you know what I mean. Another AWP and another big price drop here. Here we've got the AWP Mortis Field Tested Float. Massive drop, not very good. Here we have a Desert Eagle Light Rail. You can also see the price has dropped quite a bit here. Here we have one of my favourite skins, the M4A4 Desolate Space, a very nice looking skin and very common in many people's inventories. Here we've got the minimum wear version, another big price of another big price drop here of over four dollars. Having said that, you can pick one up for less than seventeen dollars, which would be a good buy in my opinion. Another one of my favourite skins in which I own multiple times in the past is the budget friendly AK47 Elite Build. Still a pretty cheap skin for a good looking AK. Another AK is the AK-47 Neon Revolution. A big price drop here as well. It went from $28 to just below $22. By now you should get the point. Prices across the board have dropped by a massive amount. But why? It was simple. The new operation broker thing dropped and this has broken the marketplace. Is it this is simply because a lot of the existing gamers wanted to fund, wanted the funds to invest in the new passes, new cases, and new skins, etc. It also flooded the market with um, new items, so the older items were less desirable. So what should you do? Well, that's a good question. If you already own these skins mentioned in this video, I will suggest that you hold on to them as we are heading towards a busy Christmas period. In the next few months, these skins will probably rise in price and be back to where they were before the new operation started. If you're looking to buy and invest in skins, now is a great time as prices are cheap. If you made it this far, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. See you in the next video.